Bella Ballard is the 2023 Rose Queen, and uh, congratulations. Thank you. Pretty exciting stuff, huh? Yes, it is. Now you're not you're not like other queens because there's something very different about you. Yes, there is. It is. I attend online school. I'm the first royal court member to do so, and I'm very proud to represent every online kid out there. Now, why, why do you do that? Is that COVID related or is it another reason? No, I've been attending online school since the seventh grade, actually. Since I'm a soccer player, um, a normal school wouldn't really uh, fit my schedule. So being in online school, in an online school system, it's very flexible and allows me to play soccer. Now we talk about the thing this year being turning the corner. Uh, we're turning the corner on a lot of things, aren't we? We are. Yeah, name a couple for me. For one, the pandemic, we're turning the corner from that. We're turning the corner into new leadership, women leadership, such as Ms. President uh, Amy Wayne Scott. Um, I think we're turning the corner in a lot of things. Well, we turned the corner on having somebody as queen from an online school. <laughs> yes. That, that's, that's a little glass shattering, right? It is, yes. You know, we, we talk about the parade itself. This is the 100th and... 34th. 34th. Yes. And you're the 100th and... 4th. Rose Queen. Queen. Yes. And, and so there's quite a tradition behind you. There is. Yes. There's a big... There's a lot of historical importance. Um, we represent the city of Pasadena, which holds so much um, value and tradition. And it really is an honor to represent such an important historical tradition. And, and, and when you think about New Year's Day, which this year is actually January 2nd. Yes. But when we think about the day of the parade, it's not just Pasadena. No. It's the eyes of the world that are watching you. And how does that feel? It's it's a big honor. It's is it a, big, a little daunting? A little sometimes. It's a big responsibility, but I view it as just an opportunity. <laughs> well, what do you think about when you think about all the Rose Queens that have preceded you? I think there's a lot of historical importance there. I think they uh, represent a huge, important part of Pasadena and the Terminal Roses, and it really is an honor to be a part of it. You know, think about that. I think it's an interesting idea, an interesting concept that was implemented a while ago. Would you like to see them come back? I believe that the Terminal Roses and the Royal Court is an all-female group, and it should stay like that because there is not, there's nothing like this in the world. And it's so important to represent such diverse members of the community of Pasadena in such a, to be honest, memorable and amazing way. You know, you're, you're very diplomatic. When are you running for president? <laughs> 2034. There you go. Okay, great. Let's